Hi, I'm Greg from Source Fabric, and in this video I'm going to introduce some of the new features in our most current Superdesk editing tool, Editor version 3. When you create a new piece of content in Superdesk, you'll be doing your work in the software's editor window, and the first few updates I'm going to explain are designed to enhance the editing process inside your newsroom. The first feature is called Inline Comments, and this update gives writers and editors the ability to collaborate with other newsroom users in much the same way you might in Google Docs. To make a comment and tag a colleague, highlight the text you'd like to comment on. Now write your message. And when the recipient writes back, a notification will appear here on the right. Finally, when the issue is resolved or the question answered, click Resolve and the comment will be removed. The second update allows you to keep better track of different document versions. For example, if I make an edit, save it, and then want to revert or go back to a previous draft, I'd go to the Versions History tab, locate the correct version, and then hit Revert, restoring the previous version. Both of these software updates are back-end enhancements that your readers will not see. They are designed to improve the way people work in your editorial department. The next feature, on the other hand, is meant to help enrich your content for readers. We call this annotations, and it helps break down jargon-filled prose in your text. So, to add an annotation to your text, in the Editor pane, highlight the term or idea that you want to explain. Next, type your explanation here in the pop-up window and click Submit. Now, I've created a demo of this piece of content on one of our testing websites, to show you how the annotation might show up when published. As you'll see here, next to the annotated text, a footnote number has been added. If we follow the footnote to the bottom of the page, we'll find the explanation. Of course, this feature is customizable, and it's possible to configure annotations as click-to-display definitions, meaning an explanation window opens in the text itself, rather than a footnote at the bottom of the page. Either way, this feature is a great add-on to bring more depth to a published piece of content and to keep your readers on your site. So there you have it, just a few of the new features we've built into Superdesk's updated editor tool. There's plenty more that makes Superdesk the open source CMS of choice for newsrooms around the world. For a full list and to see our development roadmap, visit superdesk.org or follow the link in the video description below. And as always, feel free to contact us directly with questions or to schedule a free Superdesk demo. I'm Greg from Source Fabric. Thanks for watching.